When I was growing up, I constantly heard things such as, we can't afford it, or money is the root of all evil, or don't talk about money, or people will take advantage of you, or money is something men think about and women just don't understand. And my favorite, make sure to marry rich so you don't have to worry about money. I didn't know it at the time, but hearing these things over and over again actually created a lot of limiting beliefs for myself when it comes to my capacity to earn money. As an immigrant, I always valued hard work and dedication, but when I started my business, I really sacrificed a lot. I sacrificed my relationships, my friendships, my free time. But then I saw other people online that seemed to be completely thriving, you know, people that seemed to just be magnetic to money, just attract money. And I had no idea what I was missing. Even though I had learned some habits and learned some mindsets and I was making six figures in my business, it seemed like I was kind of spending most of it every month. So I was still pretty much living paycheck to paycheck and it was very, very stressful. And at that point, I realized that, you know what? I was missing something and I needed to figure out what that was. And it's really no surprise. No one had ever taught me finance, investing. I was in my mid twenties and I didn't even know what a savings account was. I had no idea that investing is something you should actually be looking into now versus later. And I, I honestly felt like I wasn't smart enough to figure it out. I was so overwhelmed by the prospect and everything I would look online was just speaking in a language that I did not frankly understand. So I kept pushing it off to the side doing my thing and it got to a point where I knew something needed to change. I had a lower month than normal in my business years ago and I started to freak out because oh my gosh what if that's a production that's going to keep happening? I have nothing in savings. I felt like you know what's gonna happen to me? Am I gonna have to move back to my parents house? What am I gonna do? And at that moment I realized that I need to do something differently. I started to really look at what do I need to figure out in order to embrace this whole concept of creating actual actual wealth, being able to be smarter when it comes to finance. There really weren't a lot of resources that I found that made it easy until I found Ramit Sethi's I Will Teach You Be Rich. That book changed everything for me. So since then, I've actually gotten to enjoy the idea of saving money and managing my money better and being able to actually invest in my future. This is something I never thought about before and I know it's it's almost honestly embarrassing to say that I never thought about this because no one ever taught me. I work with so many coaches and that a single one told me that, you know, Camila, maybe you should be putting your money off to the side so you can pay this and that, you can pay taxes, you can save, you can invest versus just spend, spend, spend more so you feel abundant. I knew that something was just not quite right with that. So I have started to speak with a few of my students and community members inside of my main business, Heart Behind Hustle, and I realized this recurring pattern that women and men actually didn't really know a lot when it comes to finance. You know, just like me, they didn't know how to be a smart, financially responsible person that also is able to invest in themselves and is able to create a luxurious life, a freedom-based life that actually serves them. Most of the things that I would see out there is either save and be just a total Scrooge or, you know, just splurge and just think about the mindset and that's it, right? So I knew there had to be some people just like where I was a few years ago. And look, I'm still in the process of learning. So I wanted to create this passion project, this channel, this brand, Money Like Honey, to show you the things that I've learned in the process of building a successful business, specifically when it comes to money. What are the things that I did in order to attract more money, get aligned with actually being able to generate more money, a lot of the mindset beliefs that I needed to overcome so that you can do the same, and the things that I have learned and I'm still learning in personal finance and wealth creation and investing and the things that actually are normally pretty boring, I really wanna show you that it doesn't have to be that way. It gets to feel sweet. It gets to feel fun. It gets to feel like are able to attract money, manage money and generate money and invest money. Like bees to honey, hence the name money like honey. And if you are an entrepreneur, a professional, pretty much anyone that wants to actually feel like a responsible person and have fun with your money. I mean, don't get me wrong. We're going to talk about investing in yourself. We're going to talk about spending it in ways that are smart for you, but also being smart for the future that you want to actually build. We're going to talk about a lot of topics and we're not going to talk about marketing and sales. That's something I talk about in my main business. So you don't have to necessarily have a business to, um, 
feel like you, you belong here. I wanted to bring you behind the scenes on the things I already do know and the things I'm still learning because we're all in it together. So if that resonates for you, if you wanna stick around, I would love for you to go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I would love, love, love to see you inside of this channel. I'd love to see you in the comments section to let me know that you're in and I look forward to seeing you. My goal is to release new videos uh, a few times a month. I don't know if I have a schedule yet. We'll see. And I just really want to show up and, and support you guys as I wish someone supported me in this process, to be honest. So, so happy to have you here. Thank you so much. And I look forward to seeing you in future videos.